The behavioral observation and intervention approach aims to prevent accidents by increasing workers' behavioral awareness and getting them to take actions that reinforces safe work practices and prevents human errors. If all workers adopt this approach, it can create a strong safety culture with team members who look out for one another at work. This video highlights three scenarios in process plants where employees observe their work environment, identify hazards and prevent possible accidents. In the first scenario, a worker was tasked to open a flange joint. He had assumed that it was safe to proceed as clearance was given to him to do so. The pressure gauge indicated that the pipeline was still pressurized, but the worker struck it off, assuming that the gauge was not working. He was about to perform the line break on a pipeline that was still pressurized. Do not attempt to break any line which is pressurized. When the line is supposedly depressurized but there is a pressure gauge reading, do not assume that the pressure gauge has malfunctioned. When in doubt, consult the supervisor and report any unsafe conditions. In turn, the supervisor will check with the plant owner to validate and if necessary, rectify the situation. In this scenario, a worker was carrying a bucket of paint when he spilled some of the contents on the ground. Ensure that the bucket cover is properly tightened before carrying it. Do not walk away and leave the situation unattended. Alert others of the spillage and barricade the area. Report a spill if you see one. In this scenario, a worker was walking to his assigned workplace. There was a series of pipelines across his pathway to his workplace. The worker intended to take a shortcut by stepping onto the pipelines to gain access to his workplace. Do not take shortcuts by stepping directly onto the pipelines or instrument tapping. Workers could slip, trip or fall while stepping and walking on the pipelines. Stepping on pipelines directly, especially small bore pipeline or instrumentation tapping, could cause leak or pipe breakage. As a result, workers could be exposed to chemicals from the leakage. Always use the proper means of access, such as steps provided. The aim of the Behavioural Observation and Intervention Program is to correct and not to punish unsafe behaviour. In this positive work environment, employees from all levels in a workplace are motivated to adopt safe work practices, while at the same time, identify and correct unsafe behaviours of themselves and those around them. It moulds a team with better situational awareness and improves the overall safety and health condition in a workplace. <laughs>